The Michigan legislature gaveled in its 101st legislative session in January, and two familiar faces will be chairing the House and Senate Agriculture Committees, Senator Kevin Daly and Representative Julie Alexander. So we've got to redo MEEP and make sure that MEEP stays alive. MEEP's such an important uh, program for us across the country and across the state of Michigan, but we are, are seen as a as a uh, leader in that uh, department and what we do here is pretty important. So we gotta make sure that MEEP came in. You know, MEEP was, uh, as you probably know, was uh, the number one and number two bills that uh, uh, Governor Snyder signed. Uh, I was in the house at that time and those were actually, one of those was my piece of legislation. So that's important to me and we wanna make sure that MEEP gets done. Uh, we've got some issues with hemp to make sure we can meet the federal uh, guidelines with hemp. And so we're going to have to make some changes there in the law to help uh, that make sure that happens. I do know that going forward this term, uh, uh, we are going to try to keep animal issues uh, like dog issues and that. Hopefully those will be coming. Pets and those type of bills will be coming to the Ag Committee as well, because that's so important for animal rights issues. Uh, we don't want those to get tied up into some some situations where they get uh, you know, because they can affect us. What we do with pets will affect animal agriculture in the long run. Meanwhile, in the other chamber, Representative Alexander is anticipating a hearing for House Bill 4031, introduced by Representative Bronna Colley. Colley's bill will amend the Michigan Occupational Safety and Health Act by increasing the reporting time from eight hours to seven days and reducing the civil penalty from $5,000 to $500 when a fatality has occurred on a small family farm. To me, for my OSHA, to have our state government enter in and fine a family for not reporting that loved one's death in a matter of hours with an exorbitant fine is a bill I am very happy and excited again that Representative Colley is picking up and, and it will introduce to our committee in the very near future. To me, that's just, it's not showing sympathy, empathy to that family. It's not good policy. And to me, it's an overreach of our state government.